I believe, you know, I'm from, I'm from, I grew up, as you know, in Britain, and our greatest writer, of course, is Shakespeare. And you told me in one of our past uh, conversations that you even translated some of Hamlet into Yiddish. Yes, I've taken it out of my mouth. Uh, I, I translated one night here in Prague, uh, uh, right in this room. Uh-huh. Well, oh, I, uh, one night I couldn't fall asleep. Uh, do you want to read us just a few lines? I, I, I went to, uh, to this living room and started translating Hamlet's monologue. You want it's, to, would you like to recite a few lines? You are absolutely uh, to do it. And I had it published in this book. Here it is. Mm -hmm. Gott, zu sein, zu nicht zu sein, das ist die Kasche. Zu edlere Sinne mit Geist zu leiden, dem Besen Gorils stehen Warfer zum Feilen, zu sich bewaffnen und an Schäden machen, nach Soft zum Jamf von Zorros. Deut a Schloff, nicht mehr und mit a Schloff, a Sof mir machen zum Harz wegig und deut in der Natur klappt, was jarschend unser Guf, zu sich der Greifen Bernd zu begehren. Starben, schlafen und auf Scherholmen. Ot ist die Sterung. In Deutschloff, wo sie rechaläumes kommen, wenn die Beholle Sterbliche mir oben mal rob gewarfen. Ot ist die Machschove, was macht Puronjes na so lang leben, weil wer wollt euch gestanden Pech von Zeit, dem Umjäuscher mit Zad dem Unterdrieger. Dem stolzen Manns Beleidigung, die Leiden von Liebe, ob gewärtigter Versammlung von dem Gesetz, die Chutzpe von der Macht, die Wirtschaftung mit Zad die Unwirdige, was nennt die Wirde auf von sei Zavlonisch, wenn er allein von Obzollen sein Herrschen mit der Kinschau. Wer euch stehen wollt, die Lasten zu schwitzen und rein mit den Dickleben, wenn nur der Schreck von etwas noch ein Deut. Dem nicht entdeckten Land, von wann an Kerkin reisen, der sich nicht zurück, dem will nicht bringen in Verlegenheit, und uns nicht machen besser ausleiden, die Zorros, was da mir oben, ey, der fliehen zu, die andere, was unbekannt uns seinen. Also, mach Schoves machen uns, ach Donin. Also, wer der entschlossen, skypolier, blass, wie die bleiche Farben von Gedank. Und Unternehmungen, was seinen Fuhl mit wichtiger der Häubene Kavones, die strommen sehr bald auf Seit, verkehren, verlieren wir die Welt von Tat. Very good. If anyone who doesn't speak English and didn't understand, that was of course the famous to be or not to be monologue. Um, Jenny, I just wanted to mention, there is a slight revival in Yiddish around. I even have a I love Yiddish t-shirts here in Yiddish and also as you may have heard Netflix has a show at the moment called Unorthodox about uh, yeah, yeah. Satmar Jews and what I want to say is it's largely in Yiddish and it's become the number one Netflix show in countries like Spain where there are hardly any Jews and the Jews that are from Spain are Sephardi so they don't speak Yiddish anyway. So I raise a Yiddish circle in Madrid Oh, yes? I know its founders and its members. Okay, so that's interesting. So I think that this is really, a, besides the fact there that... Are, there are some Jews living in Madrid too. There are some, uh, well, look, my father, for example, also understood Yiddish from his father as a child growing up. But in London, in the East End, not, you know, before the Second World War, there was a Yiddish uh, poets and plays and cultural scene. But of course, in Britain, outside of the ultra-Orthodox community, hardly anyone speaks Yiddish today in America or Britain. So I'm glad you're part of a kind of international... Yes, no, in America they do. Maybe not so much in Britain, but in America there are, there is a number of Yiddishists. No, there are Yiddishists, but what I mean is that uh, two or three, a couple of generations ago, many, half the Jews spoke Yiddish. Today it's something of a rarity, unless you're an ultra-Orthodox Jew. Yeah. 